If you suddenly see an inconceivably beautiful gem lying on a green and very succulent, a mangrove, for example, leaf, do not be so quick to believe in your incredible luck. The transparent and clear drop may not turn out to be a treasure, but a common caterpillar, which goes by the name of crystal. This fantastic creature is just a larva, which will later turn into a dalcerity moth, a spectacular orange and fluffy butterfly. It was photographed not long ago by Gerardo Icebero, a scuba diving instructor and wildlife photographer. It happened in Mexico, near Cancun. Acraga coa, that is the name of the crystal caterpillar in Latin, likes warm and humid tropical climates, so you can find it in the forest wilds of South and Central America or the Caribbean islands. It looks like a crystal made of a great number of beads, which seem to be accurately and precisely matched by the hand of a real master or professional jeweler. Inside each transparent bead of this natural masterpiece is a tiny red drop. It is from the multitude of these droplets that the soft nap will grow later, which will cover the body of the future dalcerid after pupation. The crystal caterpillar itself is quite small, only about 25 millimeters long. For this reason it is quite difficult to notice it. In addition to this it is difficult to see the masking, which gives transparency, because the leaf on which it is located is visible through the caterpillar's body, so it actually merges with the background. Only red spots suspiciously collected in one place and visible to the experienced eye are giving it away. There are many species of pearl larvae, more than 80. What they all have in common is that they are very sticky, have about the same oval shape and rounded spines, which vary in a variety of patterns and colors. Some of the Dalcerity caterpillars are very brightly colored, some are not colored at all and are completely transparent. The screaming color of some of them is a puzzle for scientists. The Plains Taper, Topyrus terrestris, lives in northern South America. Its body is covered with brownish-black fur, with light-colored spots visible in some places. On the neck a thick mane. This animal is hunted because the locals are very fond of its meat. In most cases, the hunt ends successfully, since the taper cannot run well, and it is not always possible to hide in the water. The mountain taper, Topyrus pinchak, is found in the dense forests of Colombia and Ecuador. This is the smallest member of the taper family. It differs from the two previous species by its monochromatic thick wool and absence of mane. The taper, Topyrus indicus, is found in Southeast Asia. They are especially numerous in Thailand, Burma, and the Malacca Peninsula. Its coat is bicolor, the middle part of the body is light, as if covered by the cheprak, while the forelegs and tail are dark brown. Thanks to such coloration, the taper can camouflage itself among vegetation in the jungle. The caprical taper is noted for its excellent swimming skills. Many of them even mate in the water. Despite its clumsiness, the taper is very strong and agile. When danger approaches, it hides in a pond and stays there until the enemy leaves the territory. Underwater, the taper combines the pleasant with the useful it not only hides from the aggressor, but also allows the fish to clean its skin from parasites. Tapers adore salt and are ready to travel any distance in search of a treat. The trails, trampled by tapers, look like a country road. They are sometimes used by engineers when designing new roads. The Chinese and Japanese translate the name of this animal as dream eaters. Tapers are the least studied animals of all mammals. 
No one knows exactly how they build relationships within their groups and why they make a strange whistling sound. All four remaining tapir species are listed in the red. All four remaining tapir species are listed in the red book and are protected by the Wildlife Foundation. If you like this video and want to know more interesting things about animals, subscribe to our channel and get the latest and greatest news about the animal world first.